after he gets settled, then I'll start recording. Oh, goodness. Hey everyone, today I am going to make a what I got for Christmas haul. And if you hear purring in the background, it's my cat. He's sitting up at my desk while I film. And I really just wanted to film this because I enjoy watching videos like these and I think it's a fun thing to look back on in the future. And of course it's not to brag or anything, um, I just want to show what I got for Christmas for anyone who's interested. So let's get started. Alright, the first thing I was going to show are the Christmas pajamas that I'm wearing. They're not really Christmassy, they're kind of just a camping winter scene. These are from Chelsea Piers. They are a pajama company. They're probably my favorite. I have several pairs of Chelsea Pierce pajamas and my mom got me these. They're on ASOS and then they also have their own website so I did do a little Black Friday shopping. Okay, to start off, I'm gonna start with this cute bag I got from my boyfriend's family. So after I did Christmas Eve with my family, then me and Sam went over to his house to celebrate Christmas Eve with his family, and they got me some really good things. So I'll start with what his sister Abby got me. She got me this S candle, which is really cute, and it smells like, my brother said it smelled like sugar plum, but I'm not sure if it's supposed to be a holiday. But it does have some candy and floral smells, scents. It does smell like, okay? It does smell like candy and has a floral after tone, after note. Then Abby also got me this mug that matches. It has the monogram on it and it's so cute. Love this. And then his sister Casey got me this Give Me Glow palette. And she did a really, really good job picking out the colors. And two of the colors she had me pick out, and then one of them she picked for me, which I love. Casey got me hooked on this brand, so definitely recommend. Sam's mom also got me an iPad charger, and you can see I already broke into this. So that was a practical thing that I asked for, which was really nice of her to get me. And another practical thing Sam's mom got me was some of these reusable Ziploc bags. These will be very useful for travel and just really anything. Abby also got me this box of scrunchies, which I already have opened and used. I really like these. This is a present that Sam's mom got for me and Sam to enjoy together. I have not played this game before, but I'm really excited. I have heard of it and I've seen ads for it on my Instagram, so I know I'm definitely going to enjoy this, so this is going to be really fun to try. And Sam's mom also got me this really, really cozy cardigan. I'll go ahead and put it on. And it's really soft. She did a great job picking it out. It also has pockets, which I love. So this is gonna be really great when it gets cold, finally, maybe next week. It was 80 degrees on Christmas, so pretty warm. Okay, and then on Christmas, my aunt got me a bag full of goodies. She kind of did a spa theme, which I really like. So she got me this cheese board because I love, there's dog hair on it, because I like making charcuterie boards. It's tasty and fun. She got me these koala hand warmers, so cute. And some other beauty products, beauty masks, eye masks, um, face wipes, foot masks, so I can have a full spa day face mask and then she got me this really cute magnet from Albuquerque New Mexico she went there oh and she got me a heel repair kit and then I also asked for some socks I've already worn a few of these but uh, she got me zebras cheetah hedgehogs this one's really cute time to wind down sloths with wine she got me these aloe moisture gloves and socks. These are gonna be really nice when it gets dry. I get really dry in the winter. And then she also got me some other fuzzy socks which I've already worn and they're in the laundry. So I'm already getting good use out of these. My brother Trent, he got me this mug I asked for. Beautiful, I love horses. I love it. I don't know if I'm gonna put pens in it or actually use it. It's so pretty, I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but I love the box too, so I'll probably have the box sitting somewhere. 
I tend to do that. All right, and then from my mom, she got me these shoes, these Reebok shoes, which I used to have uh, two pairs of Reebok in high school, and then uh, I guess I kind of out I wore them and outgrew them, um, and then I've been wanting some ever since. I just hadn't found any colors that I liked. Since COVID, it seems like they haven't had as many colors, so I got these, and they're really comfortable and really cute. I love them. My mom also got me this horse jacket. I love orange, love horses. I'll go ahead and put it on. It has Sherpa on the inside. It's so warm, I'm, not, I'm sweating right now putting it on, but I just wanted to show you guys. I actually have uh, another jacket with horses that's from the same brand, Wild Kind. Their patterns are just so pretty and their jackets are really good quality. Before I finish filming, I just remembered I did forget something. My brother, JD, got me the a new DLC for Planet Zoo, which is the European Expansion Pack, and I've already played it and it's lots of fun, but I didn't want to leave that out. My mom also got me this sweatshirt, and it was kind of a prank because my Grammy opens up the sweatshirt and then I'm like, oh my gosh, mom, why didn't you get me one? I was thinking this, I didn't say it, I think I said something like, oh, I need one of those, and then later I open up a present and this is in there and I was so happy I was like oh my gosh thank you for getting this for me because I love it yeah I needed it in my life I knew it if you know me you know I love birds and I think this is a boreal chickadee not 100% sure since this is not a chickadee in my area pretty sure it's a boreal chickadee on some pine and the color is like a sage green so it's so pretty my dad got me this real tree shirt. I am not a hunter or anything, but as a birder, it is nice to have some camo for getting near those skittish birds. Uh, because I live kind of in an urban area, most of the birds are okay. I can wear normal clothes. However, sometimes we go places where I really think some camo would help me get some up close shots. So this is the beginning of my tree wardrobe, I guess. Okay, and then some little things my mom got me. She grabbed this tanning mitt for me, some little stocking stuffers. She got me a NYX eyeshadow pencil. This is the one I use in Auburn. It's my favorite. And then I already used this today. This is the Stila liquid eyeshadow. I love these. This one's in smoldering satin. So pretty, I'm wearing it on my eyes now. My mom was so thoughtful and got me every bird feeder that I'll need when I move out. So I still live at home and next year I'm hoping to start my career and I will be moving out. So my mom got me the entire bird feeding setup I'm going to need for when I move. So let me go ahead and show those. All right, for the first bird feeder, my mom got me this tray feeder, hanging tray. I really like this Eco Tough plastic. It's made out of reused bottles. Tray feeder is probably the number one feeder you're gonna want at your home if you're doing backyard bird feeding, so this is kind of the essential staple. Here is another EcoTuff plastic. This is a suet feeder, and then it also has the tail prop for woodpeckers. And then this bird feeder might not look special or anything. It is relatively inexpensive. However, we have two, and it is one of the most beloved tube feeders at my house. Sometimes they just like a inexpensive feeder and that's perfectly fine. It's good to pay attention to things like that. So thank you, mom. For the last bird feeder, my mom got me this hummingbird feeder. I really love its glass and red, which is great because you don't want to put red hummingbird feed in there. You're just going to want to use sugar and water. So the red is really good so that they can see it when they're passing over. And then this is the base part. And I love this because when you take it apart, there's not much going on inside, which is really great for when you need to clean it. The other thing I like about this is that the flowers are red, which is great because some hummingbird feeders have yellow flowers on them, and the yellow flowers will sometimes attract bees, so this red flower is great, and it's very, it's very fancy looking. I like the brown. Yeah, this is just beautiful. I also wanted to show the ornament that my mom got me for Christmas this year. This is, oh, that's my dog. This is the Danbury Mint 2021 Christmas ornament, and it is so pretty. I love it. So this is going to look great with my other bird ornaments I got. Thank you, Mom. 
My boyfriend Sam got me this super cute possum fanny pack. I love it. I really like wearing a fanny pack when I'm um, out and about, especially birding or uh, wildlife photography. And then if I have my dog with me, I can put, I can attach her leash through this loop so then my hands are free. Cute. And the inside is pink. Oh my gosh. He said he got me one other thing, but it hasn't come in the mail yet um, by the time I'm filming this. So I'll just show this for now. I love it. And I wanted to show one of my favorite things that my mom got me. Oh my god. Look at this. Isn't this the cutest thing ever? So this is a hedgehog rug. And my dog was just laying on it, so I kind of had to... Uh, nudge her off of it so I could show you but I love this rug and it's so soft and this is actually from a small business in Texas too it's called shop Zoki so what are you doing <laughs> my dog's like you woke me up from my nap and then you took my rug away I took your rug away up, up, up. here's my little baby Here's little Elsie, she wanted to be in the video. If you hear this, those are her little bells on her collar. So she kind of interrupts any videos that I make, but she wanted to be in the video, yay! She loves the rug. Oh my gosh, her and Ferdy, my cat, they got on the rug right away, they love it. It's just so soft. It's one of my favorite things that I got. Thank you so much for watching my What I Got for Christmas haul. I hope you enjoyed, and if you got me a Christmas present this year, thank you so much. Hopefully I didn't leave any out, and I hope you guys had a really great Christmas and Happy New Year's. Bye!